There are a lot of myths and misconceptions about lightning. Here are some of the most common lightning myths debunked. Can lightning strike the same place twice? Let's figure out what makes it happen in the first place. Lightning is electricity, and electricity involves tiny particles. Some particles have a positive charge, and some have a negative charge. The two opposite charges pull towards each other, like the north and south facing ends of a magnet. Usually, electric charges are fairly balanced. But the turbulent winds of a storm cause electric charges to separate within the cloud. Most lightning occurs within the cloud itself, but we are concerned about the lightning that happens between the cloud and the ground. Lightning starts with negative charges moving from the clouds towards the ground. Scientists call this a stepped leader. Meanwhile, an upward leader is formed as positive charges moving from the ground, usually from tall objects. When a stepped leader and an upward leader meet, it makes a path for a much larger and brighter electrical current to shoot up into the cloud. This is what we see in the sky as lightning. It happens so quickly that lightning seems to travel from the clouds to the ground, when in fact, the opposite is true. So can lightning strike the same place twice? Absolutely. Here are some other well-known myths about lightning unveiled. So, a lot of people think someone that has been struck by lightning is electrically charged and should not be touched. This is not true. Someone struck by lightning is not electrically charged, so you should tend to them immediately. The charge will actually pass through them. You would think you were safe from lightning under clear blue skies, right? Wrong. Lightning can actually strike 10 to 15 miles from the storm. It's often said that people are most likely to be struck by lightning during an outdoor activity such as golf. But golf doesn't even make the top 12. It is actually water sports that put most people at risk. Lightning is a dangerous phenomenon, and knowing what is true and what is false about lightning is essential to staying safe. 